How to improve your bedroom for maximum energy levels. When our bedroom is a sanctuary, it helps us relax, rest and replenish ourselves. However, most people don't realize how many little things in sleep environment can drain our energy, making us vibrate on a lower frequency. In addition, if you do your law of attraction exercises in your bedroom, it is doubly important to make sure it is a sacred space. Here are some ideas for bedroom makeovers that will promote higher energy levels and help you start the new day on the right foot. Replace your mattress when you invest in a good mattress, you invest in your overall health and general happiness. Mattress quality is somewhat subjective and can be determined by your body shape, pre-existing injuries and texture preferences. So, make sure you try out a wide range, and read plenty of reviews, before making a final choice. More companies are producing excellent mattresses for lower prices these days. Therefore, don't just assume you can't afford a replacement. A comfortable bedroom is a tranquil bedroom. Once you have the perfect mattress you'll wonder why you didn't make this change years ago. Keep food out it can be tempting to munch on a tasty snack under the covers, but when you eat in the bedroom you send the wrong messages to your brain. More specifically, it begins to think that the bedroom is another activity zone associated with wakefulness. This makes it harder to calm down or fall asleep even when you haven't eaten in bed that particular night. Plus, eating too close to bedtime can lead to digestive discomfort and distracting gurgling when you lie down. This is just another reason to keep food out of the bedroom. Go for minimalist bedroom decoration clutter and chaos in your bedroom can be too stimulating for the mind, once again drawing the wrong association in your brain. If you want to condition yourself to get the kind of restful sleep that boosts your energy levels, only keep things in the bedroom if you really need them there or if they actively contribute to a sense of peace. For example, a painting of a sleepy seaside scene is a great addition. However, a stack of magazines is less productive. In addition, remember that the best colors for the bedroom are also calming, soothing shades like pale blues and greens, rather than bright, intense colors like red and orange. Be sure to regularly purge your room of materials you no longer need or want. Read our ultimate guide to decluttering here. Get rid of the TV studies have repeatedly shown that the blue light emitted by televisions and other electronic devices e.g. laptops and smartphones can interrupt the body's natural rhythms and interfere with the sleep cycle. So, it's smart to avoid keeping these things in a bedroom. They're more at home in a living room or den instead. Plus, there are plenty of other things you can do in bed before sleeping, like reading a book, journaling and meditating. Once you remove electronics from your bedroom, you condition your mind to view it as a quiet, calm place. You'll be amazed by how much easier it is to fall asleep. Make sure lighting is low just as the colors of the walls and bed linen impact on your ability to relax and get a good night's sleep, so too does the general lighting. Your body will still think it's the middle of the day if you have all the lights on. You need to give your brain a chance to process the fact that it's dark outside, and to adjust your hormone balance accordingly. So, stick with candles and softly glowing lamps at night. These also give your eyes a much needed rest, especially if you work with computers during the day. Find scents that make your bed a sleep sanctuary planning a room makeover isn't just about how things look. You may have already found certain scents that enhance positive emotions or concentration as part of your manifestation work, but if you haven't looked into the power of odor before then now is a great time to start. Some people like to light a scented candle for a little while before bed, while others even apply a little essential oil to their pillow or to a piece of fabric inside the pillowcase. Some research suggests that sandalwood and lavender are particularly good at reducing stress, inducing feelings of calm and counteracting anxiety, so you might want to start with those. Figure out how to make your room cooler finally, there is strong evidence that that learning how to make your room cooler can play a major role in the quality of your sleep and thereby in determining your energy levels the next day. Sleep experts caution that a temperature between 60 and 67 degrees is best. Hotter temperatures, in particular, can cause disruption to rest. So, keep an eye on the temperature in your room. Don't just judge it based on feel. This could make the difference between a night of blissful rest and a night spent tossing and turning.